everyone, it's Eunice and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be talking about the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Edit Unlock palette. So this is a palette for the, I think, Hourglass's holiday collection. Honestly, I've been wanting to try their ambient lighting palette, but then I thought that the shades in that palette were a little too light for my skin. And then when I saw this and I saw the swatches, I was like, okay, somebody's messaging me. But yeah, when I saw the um, swatches online, I was like, oh my gosh, this one is totally perfect for me. So this is the palette right here. It retails for $80 and it has six shades and 5% of the profit of this palette will go to the non-human rights project or i believe it has something to do with like animal cruelty i feel like so yeah you can see like my setup from that so it comes in like that shiny metal plastic packaging and as you can see it's like a special packaging for this um actually you can't see that maybe here maybe in the box you can see yeah so that's like the logo for the palette it has that little bunny because like i said they are giving five percent of the profits of these palettes to the non-human rights project so it comes with a huge mirror for the face and it comes with six shades so the first two shades right here are blush shades so we have the blush nude glow and the blush mood blush and then we have like a highlighter right here and then we have two finishing powders and a bronzer so I already have like um foundation and concealer on so I'm going to go ahead and set my face with a product so that we can test it out. So first and foremost, I am using this dual fiber brush from Luxie and I am taking the darker filter light shade right here and I'm just going to lightly dust that all over my face. Now I'm going to bronze my face using this bronzer right here with my Sigma Large Angled Contour Brush. Now I'm using my Aesthetica P12 brush. So first I'm taking this nude blush. Wow. So this is what the nude glow looks like. It's super subtle lang. And then now I'm going to try to top it off with the shade Mood Flush for a little bit of pink. Now I'm taking my Morphe highlighting brush. This is the brush M510. So I'm taking this metallic strobe light shade right here. And this is in the shade Champagne Strobe Light. And I am just going to use that to highlight my face. Oh... Here is like the finished look that the ambient lighting edit unlock palette gave my face. It's just a really subtle face palette that you can use actually use for every day. And that's why I think that it's worth it. It's super like all of the powders were so finely milled that it really looks natural on the face. Even the blush, the bronzer, and the highlighter. It's just so natural looking and it's not cakey at all and it definitely just gives your skin that your skin but better kind of look and i highly recommend it for every day if you're someone who wants something like a sheer coverage foundation and a sheer coverage look the finish that the powder gave my face is just amazing because it's so subtle it really looks like my natural skin so it really just accentuated the features of my face and not really like change the look of my face or anything like that and like i said i highly recommend it if you're someone who's looking for a more sheer coverage natural finish kind of makeup this is something that you will definitely want to invest in because the powders are just so amazing they're so beautiful they're pigmented enough to appear on your skin but not too pigmented that it's giving you so much coverage that you look like you have makeup on your face so yeah that is actually everything that i have to say about this palette it's not really a full review or anything like that i just wanted to talk about it and i 
thought that this is something that I want to start doing, just reviewing some of the products like right off the bat, what I think about them, like a small short review. So that's it for today's 2018 holiday collection first impression. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And of course, if you want to see more of these types of videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!